Hey guys, so it's Jackie with Cruise in the World with Jackie. I'm actually sitting in the car waiting for my husband at a pharmacy. Um, and I thought this would be the perfect time to get a short video in. So, I actually thought when I did the last um, video um, that that was our last stop in Florida. But I actually thought this stop was in Alabama, but it is in Florida. It is Grover Tees. Um, it's a harvest host. Um, it is in Milton, Florida. So this was, Milton was our last stop in Florida. Um, so Grover's Teas is really great for a couple of reasons. I actually did a short on this and it, it was well received. So I, I'll put the link to that down in the description. But let me tell you why it's a great um, harvest host. First of all, they do two things that no other harvesters that we've been to do. One was give something free. So um, they give you a coupon for free uh, onion rings and the onion rings were really delish. Um, the food was good, so that's great too. Um, but the other thing they do that no one's ever done, no one did the free thing either, but this, is, it, this was really, really helpful. Um, they gave you a paper um, and basically told you where everything was in the area. So it said like um, Walmart, mile and a half. I, I don't remember the exact things and I didn't keep it unfortunately, but it told you like where the Walmart was, where there was a pharmacy, where there was a movie theater. I think it gave a laundromat. It gave all the things that you would need to know. Um, so that was very helpful and it was really good. Um, it was quiet. It's a big parking lot and they have you over to the side of the gravel. When you look at the videos I did, you'll see. Um, there were three people with us that night when I recorded. I did it the next morning because I was tired that night um, and they were all gone. But there were three of us there that night. Um, it was quiet. It was nice. Free onion rings and all that information was extremely helpful. So thank you Grover Tees. Um, add it to your list if you're going through Milton, Florida. Something else I wanted to add was that um, we were heading uh, west, so we were coming in from the east, and it is on a busy road, and people had commented that you can't get across there. There's a little cutout to go into their lot, and with the trailer, it was hard. We have a small RV, 24-foot motorhome. We didn't have any problem, but if you have something bigger, you're probably going to have to go down and do a UE and come back, because unless people are really helpful, which I haven't found the drivers in Florida really helpful, um, it would be hard to get across with the traffic. Okay, like and subscribe. Thank you. Okay, Grover Tea Barbecue and Southern Cooking, Milton, Florida, Harvest Toast. Food was good. Um, they give you a free onion rings. Actually, they're probably the friendliest harvest host we've had. Well, maybe not the friendly, one of the friendliest. They give you a printout. They tell you where the Walmart Target is, convenience store. That's all really nice. And free onion rings. And the onion rings were delish. Okay. They have a huge parking lot. Over here is where we parked. There were two other campers. They left early this morning. We're going to a Court of Engineer only like two and a half hours away, which you can't get into to two o'clock. So we're kind of taking our time getting ready today. Um, but there were two other campers here. Um, they used their levelers. We didn't do anything and we were just fine for overnight. I, I, we usually don't do it unless it's really bad. Um, they had, you know, little things for the doggies. That was great. The only thing, um, Justin, FYI nothing against them this road that I'm shooting is really busy and if you're coming from the east you have to turn left in here kind of where that black car is doing now which is very easy this time of morning but at night or in the afternoon it was um, it took us a while we could have went and actually uh, Google suggested we go down and turn around we didn't do that now we only have a 24 foot uh, motorhome as you can see so we just had to wait a little bit and then we got in if you had something bigger and you'd be um, wouldn't fit into that little turn area then you'd probably want to go down and turn around if you're coming from the east if you're coming from the west it's perfect 
Like I said, this is um, a great spot in Milton, Florida, uh, almost to the Alabama border. We're heading west, so we'd stay here again. Yeah, definitely.